This is PokePress coverage of the 2010 Pokemon Trading Card and Video Game World Championships in Kona, Hawaii. So Cresselia uses Rest, which will heal all the damage done to it and put it into the sleep status. But as is a common strategy, it has a Chesto Berry, which will wake it up immediately. This also, of course, works if the other player uses something like Dark Void. However, the Leech Seed is still in effect, and Charon will still get some of that back. And Dialga comes out. Groudon returns. To be replaced by ho -Oh. And Charon comes back as well for Ludicolo. And we get our swagger from Cresselia. Now that stat change you got from the previous swagger has expired because it went out of play again. So this is a new one. And we get Elite Seed now from Ludicolo to Dialga. And a Flamethrower from Dialga to Ludicolo. And now a Psychic from Cresselia to Ho-Oh. So now Ho-Oh tries to attack. And damages itself this time. Just barely stays in there. And Ludicolo protects itself. And now Cresselia uses another Psychic on Ho-Oh. And knocks it out. And Groudon comes out. Ludicolo is swapped out. For Cherim. So Groudon protects itself. Remember it came in to replace a knocked out Pokemon, so it does get to attack this turn. Dialga protects itself.
And Groudon comes back once again. And Ludicolo comes out. Cherum protects itself. And now we get a flamethrower from Dialga to Ludicolo. And we get a Psychic. So we get a protect from Dialga, and now a grass knot from Ludicolo, I believe, to Cresselia, and now another grass knot from Cherum to Cresselia, and finally that knocks it out. So our top player now just has the one Pokemon left. So we get a Grass Knot from Ludicolo. And a Flamethrower from Dialga to Cherim. And with a critical hit, that does enough damage to knock out Cherim. And Groudon comes out. Ludicolo protects itself. And... Now Groudon will use Earthquake, which of course Dialga is weak to ground, being part steel. And that does it. That ends game one. So the bottom player is our winner for game one. This has been a PokePress Special Report.